You wanna know what the biggest clubbing tourist traps in Berlin are? Sure you do. When I was thinking about which clubs fall under that, five names in particular popped up in my head. So if you don't want to spend hours waiting in line just to end up in a tourist contaminated club, listen up. Tresor. It's one of the oldest club brands in Berlin, so a lot of people know about that one. The location may be dark enough for you not to see other tourists, but only until some Chinese girl will take a photo of you with her flashlight. Another overrun place is Watergate. I never understood in the first place why this club got famous. It's tiny, it's clean, and there's no place to chill at all. The next club is one where you can go for the next 100 years every day and never encounter a single person from Berlin. The Matrix. This one in particular is crowded with German tourists, especially from the countryside. The reason for that is because they run a lot of ads in German TV, mostly before low-level IQ reality TV shows. So unless you want to pick up some German rednecks from the countryside, Avoid this one at all costs. The last two ones are About Blank and Suicide Circus. Those two are not really bad clubs, but I still wouldn't go there anymore because they let in just about anyone nowadays. They have a really, really lax door policy. Alright, these are the most tourist overcrowded clubs in Berlin. So if you want to have a true clubbing experience here, avoid them. And if you want to know which the best clubs in Berlin are and how to get in there, check out my next video.